The hunt is on this afternoon for a predator who sexually assaulted a 79-year-old woman mm -hmm. after breaking into her home. And investigators say it was one of a string of crimes in the area. KKL 9's Joy Benedict is live in Hacienda Heights with that story for us. Hey, Joy. Hey, Juan. Hey, Susie. Yeah, this is just a terrifying story and one that has everybody here in this community very, very concerned. That particular break-in involving a woman in her 70s happened here on Quist Avenue. We are not showing you the home for obvious reasons as we don't want to accidentally identify the victim of this sexual assault. But as you mentioned, it was not the only crime during a very short period early Sunday morning. There was also another burglary and a couple of car break-ins. I want to show you an image taken from a ring camera. This is of a man investigators with the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department say was involved in one of those burglaries, but not the one that involved the sexual assault. So that's very important. You also see another ring video of a man running across the neighborhood that's also been hand over to the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department. But again, all of this happened early Sunday morning, sometimes between the times of 2 a.m. and 6 a.m. in about a four-block neighborhood here in Hacienda Heights. What we know is we had the 70-year-old woman who was sexually assaulted inside her home early that morning after someone broke in. As for that suspect, investigators see it is a young man in his early 20s that they believe committed that particular crime. That's the only information they have on him. They say there was also a separate burglary at another home. There were also two cars that were broken into and they are looking at that image that I showed you as a possible suspect in what that other home burglary but nonetheless folks here in this community are very very concerned about the crime that continues to be on the rise and they want to make sure the suspect or suspects and everyone involved is found one disturbing the peace is just bad as it is but then have you know the sexual assault that's just that's another world that's just Disgusting to me, honestly, that's wrong. Like this, whatever this guy's doing, he needs to be caught immediately because this is not okay at all. It certainly is not. Neighbors are very upset. They're very scared that this will continue. So, again, investigators with the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department are asking everyone to search through their security video. They know the string of crimes happened between about 2 a.m. and 6 a.m. early Sunday morning. That was May the 2nd. If you see anybody just darting across your lawn or running down the street, they want to see that video as they're trying to figure out who exactly committed those crimes. But again, I have to reiterate that photo that we showed you of somebody who could be a suspect in the burglary is not the suspect or they don't know if it's the suspect is the same one as in that sexual assault. So that's very important to keep in mind as they are not connecting all of those crimes at this time. I'll send it back to you guys. And some new video would be very helpful. Joy, thank you.